Uh, in Ernakulam in Kerala, there's very heavy rainfall as a result of which uh, voting has been impacted. Incessant rainfall in most parts of Kerala, including Tiruvannantapuram and Ernakulam, even as bypolls to five assembly constituencies have been underway. Ernakulam has been witnessing an inundation in several key junctions and in a few polling booths. For now, there seems to be some temporary relief with skies clearing up, but there is an orange alert for 12 districts in the state today. Let's go across to Sneha Merikoshi who joins us now for the very latest. Sneha, just how bad is the situation uh, from a humanitarian standpoint before we get to the elections? Well, uh, you know, it was very bad today morning. We had hours of rainfall, you know, uh, uh, at least over six hours of rainfall, uh, starting all the way from night and then it continued through the day. It, the skies have now cleared uh, across the state, especially in Ernakulam and Tiruvannandapuram and other uh, places where the bipoles are being held. So that has come as a relief. Now, Vishnu, before I go go on more with, with that, let me show you, this is what the scene is. Now, Kerala is known for its long queues on voting day. That is absent in most of the polling booths here. The polling poll percentage, you know, in one particular booth where I went was just about 40 plus, uh, 45, around 45 for that particular booth, when usually the polling percentage around this time would be 75 to 80 percent in that polling booth. So that's the kind of impact we are talking because of the incessant rainfall. Now, here you have, you practically ha are having voters just trickling in. But what is in store for the coming few hours, there's a 48 hours alert for extremely heavy rainfall likely all across Kerala, specifically uh, the 12 districts. Tomorrow, there's another five districts that are on red alert. So next 48 hours, extremely crucial, after which there will be a gradual decline in the rainfall, but heavy rainfall is likely to continue starting today all the way for the next five days. So that is something that the state really does need to look out. Of course, it has affected today's elections, uh, today's voting, not only in Tiruvannandapuram, also in Ernakulam. There were, uh, there were election offices, polling booths, where everything had to be shifted to the first floor, the second floor of the school because the rain was absolutely unprecedented. Uh, the chief electoral officer will take a call on whether the hours of voting really needs to be extended. So that's really the situation here. Must tell you, some of the booths here, some, some of the bipoles here are extremely high stake, um, uh, involve high stakes for all three political parties, like where I'm standing right now in Vatiurkao.